What's up, everyone? Happy Monday. We are coming to you live from the Christmas tree forest over at Crossroads Farm. Wanted to give you an update on uh, status of Christmas trees. If you didn't get your Christmas tree, uh, we still got some pretty ones over here. Look at that. It's a pretty Christmas tree right there. They smell good, too. So we still got some nice trees over here at Crossroads. And uh, we got to stop over here and give you an update. So we are two weeks from Christmas, um, two work weeks from Christmas. And uh, obviously, week after that is the last week of the year. And the new year is ahead of us. And uh, this year went fast. Wow. Um, COVID nonsense starts up again today. Mask mandate back in effect. Um, I don't know. I don't know when this is all going to end. But uh, we got to keep on living our lives and doing the best we can. And uh, looking out for all those around us. And so today's message of the day. Um, I opened up the Bible app this morning. And there was a verse there from Thessalonians. And basically it said, um, test everything that you hear. And basically decide if it's something good or something bad. Categorize it. And obviously keep the good and get rid of the bad. Um, and that was kind of interesting. That we need to evaluate everything in our life. Every situation. Everything that's said. Everything we read. And decide if it is something positive or something negative. And if it's something positive, we need to file it away in our brain and save it for later and if it's something negative we need to uh, release it possibly learn a lesson from it and uh, put it behind us uh, we can't dwell on that so as we go through each day we need to everything that we come across we need to categorize it good or bad keep it or get rid of it um because that we have a lot of stuff floating around in our heads. I know a lot of us are busy. We've got a lot of different things happening to us. And the more we fill our head up, the more, I guess, distracted we get. Maybe some more anxiety we carry around. Um, just a lot of moving parts in our heads as we're trying to accomplish tasks in our life. And if we could <clears throat> thin out our brain a little bit and just keep what's good and uh, get rid of what isn't good keep what helps us and get rid of what hurts us um, it'll help simplify our brains a little bit help simplify our lives and help us to keep moving in the right direction in a positive direction um, something to think about right from the Bible Thessalonians um, that verse also talks about um, supporting those that are good and um, those leaders and help them build up our leaders help thanking our leaders our spiritual leaders in our communities. Uh, it also talks about um, not returning evil with evil. Um, about getting out of environments that are bad. About um, not staying up late and drinking was actually mentioned in that in that section. Um, a lot of different things. So we constantly need to evaluate our lives and make sure that we're only filling our head with good stuff and getting rid of the bad stuff. Garbage in, garbage out. Uh, there's so much, so much information in this world. Uh, so much going on with the internet and social media and all this other stuff that we wind up just basically getting on an overflow in our brains. So if we can um, really stop and evaluate each thing in our life and dismiss the bad, hold on to the good, and then uh, reproduce the good out in the world, be a source of light, be that good good for everyone else in our world and uh, keep pushing out a positive message and making the world a better place as I say so there's your message um, evaluate everything in your life put it in a good and bad category and um, hold on to the good and get rid of the bad um, if you could cut 50% of the stuff out of your head you'd have a lot more clarity so alright let's jump on prayers Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to know the difference between right and wrong, and help us to evaluate everything that comes across our life. Help us to keep spreading spreading the good and spreading the love. Um, help us to help those that aren't. Uh, help us to be grateful every day for all the opportunities you put in our life and all the people you surround us with. Uh, thank you for sunshine days. We love sunshine days. Uh, amen. So, it's Monday. we got uh, three weeks left of this year. Uh, we need to make it count. So, start thinking about what we're going to do for 2022. Um, now's the time to plan, make things happen. Um, got a good year coming up. This year's closing out. So, how are you going to make next year better than this year? How are you going to continue to grow in your life? Um, how are you going to support those around you the next upcoming year? Uh, all stuff to think about, all stuff to think about. It's time to start planning. We can't run through life with, without a plan. It's like jumping in a car and driving to California without a map. We need a plan. So, start making that plan. Start planning for the future year 2022 and uh let's check in let's finish out this year strong let's be present for everybody in our lives uh, let's keep evaluating everything that's good let's keep being a source of good uh this christmas season it gets crazy people get cranky people are tired um people are worn out and let's uh keep that in mind and let's be a force of good in the world let's uh make this a joyous holiday season for everybody and uh have a great day so everyone God bless. Appreciate you all. Remember, put your head on a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Go inspire someone else around you and let all your light shine together. All right, everyone. God bless. Have a great day.